Welcome to Mishnah Stani Masachi Kitubot Perekim Mishnah Het. Over here in this Mishnah, I'm going to discuss a minor um, who is not entitled to a fine. Right? So, firstly, let's just define this. And Abam goes to it over here and he says he's going to do it here and not elsewhere. So, let's get these terms down correctly. Um, a child, right? A, a young girl, right? Up until she is 12 and she has two hairs, right? Two pubic hairs. She's considered a ketana. She is considered a minor for all times and purposes. She needs to reach both, right? She needs to have two hairs and be at least 12 years old, right? So let's say she's 12 years old, 13 years old, and she still didn't have any, she didn't have any hairs yet, then she's still considered a kitana. Now, this could go all the way up until 20, right? If she's 20, right, and she has signs of infertility that she's an ilonit, then she's going, that that's it, she's considered an ilonit forever. If she doesn't have these signs, she'll go up to 35 years old. Right from the moment she sees uh, two hairs, then she leaves the realm of ketana, and for the next six months, she's considered a ne'ara, right? Ne'ara, a lad, for six months. It doesn't matter when she sees, right, right? When she has, it could be at twelve years old, it could be thirteen, fourteen, up until thirty-five, right? As the next six months, she's considered that quote unquote ne'ara. After that, after those six months, she's considered a bogeret, right? So usually the way we, we phrase it is up until 12, she's a ketana, right? If she had, if she, if she's 12 and has two hairs for the next six months, so until 12, 12 and a half, she's considered a nara. And then from 12 and a half onwards, she's considered a bogeret. Now, Al Mishnah, right, um, is going to speak about father is technically allowed to sell his daughter as a slave, as a maidservant. Um, he's allowed to do so only when she's a minor, only when she's a kitana. So Al Mishnah is going to be according to the Mimir. And he says that anytime you're allowed to make that sale, to sell your daughter as a slave, you no longer, right, you cannot receive, right, the payment for the fine. So koma kom shi mecher in knas. Anytime father is allowed to sell, meaning when she's is still a minor, Right? In Knas, then the father is not entitled to receive the fine. Right? And the opposite is also true. Anytime there is a fine, right, he's not allowed to sell. Um, right? Meaning once she's older. Now Mishnah elaborates. Kitana, Yesh Mecher, in Knas, right? A Kitana under 12 years old, right? There is a Mecher. Right? He is allowed to sell. That is less. So in Laknas, there is no fine. Right? The Torah wasn't speaking about that age. Right? If she was raped at that age, that's not what the Torah was talking about. Na'ara, right? The Na'ara is the next stage, right? From 12 to 12 and a half. Yesh Laknas ve'en la'mecher. And she would get paid that, uh, you know, that fine. She's entitled to the fine. Ve'en la'mecher. But she's not no longer allowed to be sold. The father is only allowed to sell his daughter when she's up until, what well, when she's still a ketana. Right up until up until she's twelve, bogeret is a full fledged adult. Right, so from twelve and a half and on, lo mecher velo knas. Right, she doesn't get. Right, she doesn't receive. She's not allowed to be sold, and she also does not receive um, a uh, you know a, 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 a fine. Um, right, if she right the father's not going to receive that if if, if she was raped. Um, yeah. Now this mishnah is according to Rabbi Meir. Right, this is according to the Mir that says anytime there's there's a there's a um, there's a mecher there's a sale there is no knas. Chamim argue on that, um, and they say even if someone who sleeps with a minor, right, she's older than three, three older than three years and three years in a day, up until she's a bogeret, right, up until twelve and a half, um, that person will be obligated hayab to pay knas. Right, so according to Chamim there is a knas um and halacha is not like. Uh, Rabbi Meir, I'd also point out um, that Bogeret, right, everyone agrees that when once she's an adult, she's not allowed to be sold, right? She also does not receive a fine, right, when, uh, when the, 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 the fine payment of 50 shekel if she's raped, but she would get Boshet, Gam, and Tsar. Right, if she was if she was raped, um, if it was um, if she was uh, seduced, right, and, and it was a uh, mutual, right, there was consent, it was consent, then she wouldn't get those three either, right? She wouldn't receive um, boshet, begam, um, and sar. She wouldn't get anything, right? Um, and, and again, as we mentioned, al is not like Rabbi Meir, rather like Chachamim.